roller skating, the sport of the 80s, with a long and colorful history behind it. You can trace its beginning all the way back to 18th century Belgium. It became a marvelous form of exercise and fun for boys and girls and men and women of all ages. And the sport quickly spread to countries all over the world. The first skate wheels were wooden, later metal. But in the early 1970s, roller skating really came into its own with the invention of the urethane wheel. Originally devised for skateboards, the wheels were quickly adapted to roller skates. And the sport enjoyed a rebirth of popularity with young and old alike. By the time the 1980s rolled around, there were babysitting roller skaters. Stunt skaters. Club skaters. And music-minded skaters. Because more and more people are discovering the sport every day, there are certain aspects of it you should know to help you skate safely and really enjoy it. If you're in the market to rent or buy skates, well, you won't have far to look. Roller skating has become big business. Skates come in a variety of styles, designs, and colors. Prices range from around $20 into the hundreds of dollars. The less expensive skates will probably be less durable and could be less safe. Experienced skaters say that boot skates give the best support, so choose yours carefully. Most amateur and recreational skaters are not aware of the importance of safety gear, and this has caused an alarming number of injuries. The experienced skater and members of skate clubs are very aware of this and never skate without the proper protective equipment. The biggest danger comes from the unexpected fall. In most falls, it's the wrist that's most vulnerable. The wrist guard is a must in preventing serious fractures or breaks. Wrist fractures account for most of the 100,000 roller skating injuries reported each year. Knee pads and elbow pads will help prevent fractures and skin burns. The same holds true for gloves. And for the more daring stunt skaters, helmets are a must. The most experienced skater knows that routine maintenance and safety checks are very important. It doesn't take a lot of time and can help prevent serious injuries. <laughs> 